Hey everybody, I'm Caleb, I'm Sam, and I'm Will, and we are Working Title. It's JJK Day, this is Season 2, Episode 14, right? Yeah. Fluctuation, um, last on. We had Chozo versus Itadori. Unfortunately, Itadori got washed, and Ah, now ah. these two girls say they're going to start a ritual. What does that mean? We do not know. So, make sure you leave a like if you've been enjoying these reactions. Subscribe so you can stay around for them. And of course, when more JJK content comes out in the future, be a Patreoner. You can get some uncut uh, access over there. And for now, we will catch you in today's reaction. Love you guys. Punch it! Boom! Ew. Oh, Oh, I forgot the smallpox demon. Smallpox. Woo! Why does she get trapped in like a coffin every time? Mm. You're dead. Ugh! No, 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 you no. Get, no. <laughs> you get buried in a coffin and it gives you smallpox. And then you die. And then you die. Oh my god, that's so creepy. <gasps> oh, she already has it. Dang. That's Dang. so odd. Yeah. Oh. Bro got smallpox. Oh! Yikes. Okay. That's horrible. Why would you want a kid to do that? Whoa. Little bro just had a JoJo pose. Oh, pranked ya. Whoa. Oh, her eyes. Whoa. <laughs> He's my distraction. <laughs> Simple domain. Oh, okay. This makes me uneasy. Nope. Nice. Oh, the crow. Oh! Hey, that's tough. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Kamikaze bird strike. Okay. What? So on the brink of near death, she gains power. No one's able to stop the bird strike. Except, uh, except that except guy. Gojo. <laughs> except that fella. Hey. Oh. <laughs> I want to know how she figured out her ability is to s- uh, make birds kill you. <laughs> yeah. Like, how many crows was she touching that, like, she figured it out? For a modern sorcerer. He's an ancient sorcerer. <laughs> no. no, I haven't been, been winking. winking. <laughs> What a dick. Oh boy. Who do we got today? Yeah, who's who's the new battle? I'll take the Ooh. Oh yes! yes! Yay! Squid Finally! What? Did he beat him already? Oh, what? It's so cute. He, uh, Oh, he's liquor. crying, bro. Oh, liquor activated. Liquor activated powers. Oh, no. I actually feel a little bad for this thing. No, ah! no. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, I no horrible. longer feel bad for me. <laughs> I don't feel bad. Hey. It's just like a crab under Ew, the sea. Ew, kill it. No, under shoot it. Shoot it. That thing needs to die. Blow it up. Just like an animal under the sea. Jogo. Is he crying for his friends? I think he just misses his buddies. Oh. Oh, right. you killed Hanami! Oh no, it's about to piss this thing off. It's how I feel, little bro. My favorite. Oh. It just turned <laughs> into a man. What? Urasai! 
Ew. Yo! Oh my gosh! It was a curse wound, so it didn't even like. Hatch. Hell yeah! It's Cthulhu. He's got the wings and everything. Oh my god! It's his curse what? technique animation. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Bros Dago, no. What the hell? Oh no. Oh no, he's a graphic And the Mappa team that animates me. There's no way this is like his shtick. He's he's not even listening. Me zoning out for real. <laughs> Pops is drunk talking about frame rates. Okay. Once again, a JJK fight where everybody's jumping a curse. What are... Whoa. Is he trapping him in like a frame? In like an animation right. cell? Dang. Whoa. This thing is so odd looking. He looks so cool. Endless hate. <laughs> Bro's a gamer. Let's go. I like its voice. I do too. It's a good voice. It's like my hero music. Okay. Holy <laughs> shit. That's wild. So he has super speed based off frames. Okay, then they get frozen okay. if they wow. don't. Oh, wow, that's actually crazy. That's so... What the heck? They're rest? Okay. <laughs> Uh, so they mess up. It is what it is. So he has to make sure it's realistic. Oh, I love that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love that. And I love that they're explaining to us, but how are these guys ever supposed to know that? <laughs> it's so specific. For frames and beats. <laughs> this is definitely the MAPA team just like rolling with it, or the, I guess the story writer teasing an them. Animer. Animator. <laughs> yeah. Teasing them a bit. Oh! Is he trying to do a domain expansion? Or a spell? What the fuck is this? Whoa. Oh, it's a beach. He's taking us to where they hung out. I witnessed them play soccer there. <laughs> That's they saw them do the cheer the the they saw them do cheerleading. And cheerleading and calisthenics. <laughs> what's, what's the meme? The good, uh, the, bad, the good guys in the show, it's like super dark. Bad guys in the show. <laughs> Dancing. <laughs> Oh, Mommy, shit. I go okay. swimmies now. <laughs> so this is his lair? His domain. Like the place where he keeps them? The what of the... Oh. oh no, it's the fish curse again. Mm. Oh, nice. so convenient for this specific place. Oh. Wow! That's beautiful. Why is the soundtrack so heat right now, right? bro? That is beautiful. Right? It sounds like a Sega Genesis game, dude. Shit. Oh! You just got fish cursed. Oh! Ah! Damn. Damn. No! Damn. <laughs> bro, is they didn't even throw any at her. Oh! <clears throat> my god. Oh. This is Sam's Kabo. Come on, come on, Maki. Damn it! Moy! Why are his wings coming out of his butt? Octo oh, bitch! bitch. <laughs> oh. Yes. Yo! Where? Oh, they broke through! Where did bro come from? Mega Man! How did he break through? Yes! I forgot he could Whatever cloud. Weapons. I love those she, things. She used that in season one, didn't she? Yeah. And Ghetto used them in the movie. Scott! Damn. Oh! Okay, he actually made, or she made some impact. Yeah! Don't underestimate her. Oh, he's doing his own domain! Okay, okay. Ooh. Oh. Oh no. Does he have the dogs or something? What's gonna come out and help him? Nui. No. 
Is that not on me? It's businessman time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, oh, look at yes. that. Bro, they love this man. <laughs> oh, look at look man. man. I love this man. This what are we saying? Old. Yo. Whoa. Oh, His arm. No. The mustachioed man. Come on, Maki. A mere flesh wound. It's 71 years ago. Oh no. Dude, I can't believe he lost an arm. Fuck. <laughs> that is so cool. Oh. He's lucky he didn't lose an arm. Yeah. Man got bit by like seven fishes. Is he run out of juice? <laughs> Bro, how do you figure that kind of stuff out, man? No. Oh, uh, I don't want. I don't want Fushiguro to be left alone. Gather around, yeah. <laughs> Gather up. It's time. Wait, so they're letting somebody they're leave? We're trying to all get leave. We're trying to all leave okay. right now. Okay, okay. Ah, oh, he realizes it. No. Oh. Oh. oh, run! Dude, get out. Run! Bro, get who's be, who's being left behind? Someone's coming in. Oh shit! No, oh, it's shit. fucking no, oh, no, oh, it's Toji. Oh god! Oh, oh god! Bro, why the fuck did he come in there? Bro said he just wants to fight. That's <laughs> it. He said someone strong. He's like, hmm. He does not care about anything else. He just wants to throw hands. That's it. Oh, bro got bored. He's like, hmm, I hear fighting. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Oh. He said... <laughs> bro did not give, go uppies. Uh, give me uppies. <laughs> give me uppies, I want to play. Right, bro hit domain uppies. <laughs> Doji said, please, I want to play game. Guys, that was that episode. I don't remember the number. It's fluctuating. 14. 14. That was episode 14. Very cool. How did, uh... Man. Maybe he's looking for his son. Doubt it. Probably <laughs> just here for the chaos. I, would, I, I mean, but his son's are, are right there. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I... Okay, so two things. One, when he got revived, his name was to They called him Toji Zenny. I brought it up in the right. episode. Like, I'm just curious if that means that... Because they named him a certain thing, does that mean it's, like, that era? Like, this is a younger Toji than the one we saw at the beginning of the season? You know what I mean? Maybe one without a kid, so he doesn't necessarily know. Or maybe he does know. Maybe that's, like, an eternal spirit type of thing. Um, so they got a sample from him af not from his death? Well, no. I mean, I think clearly they had some type of sample of his body because she, the guy ate something. But more so, like, they were specifically calling upon the one... That oh, existed oh. before. Okay, so mm. if I, I or, had a or, piece of your hair and I was one of these uh, seances, I could be like Will at fifteen. Yeah, or or maybe it's just they went for prime. Like I want prime, the strongest, the strongest. Felt like he was prime when he fought Gocha. I mean, it doesn't get more prime than that. It's like no one can compete against him. So <laughs> that, that's who I'd be. A win's a from. win, bro. A win's yeah. a win. He beat the strongest. Yeah. A win's a win. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I, I don't know if that's the case. I don't know, like why. I mean, I just don't know why you would, like, what would be the reason to not revive him at his like end game state? If sure, you know what I mean. That, like that felt like peak to me. Yeah, but who knows? I mean, like, fair. <laughs> we only saw him one time. There might be more peak we don't know about. That's um, that'd be crazy. He kind of looks. I don't, and that's the thing too. It's like his. The guy he took <clears throat> over, his body was a little more slender than, like, Toji's natural body. But it mm -hmm. looks like his body... I mean, when we saw the older woman, the seance lady, in the past, she transformed and looked exactly, like, body type and all as the as the daughter when she did the, the like, assassination. Yeah. So, I don't know. I mean, it might be younger Toji. That's what it kind of gives off, at least. But I could be wrong. No, I wouldn't be allowed... That stuff's too hard for me to detect with animation. But I think he 100% is just there. I feel like probably he's just there to throw hands. He just gets dropped <laughs> he in He literally this heard the ruckus, and he was like, okay, yeah, it's time for a real fight. Yeah, he's like, all I've done today is 
take over a soul and punch an old woman really hard. I need to go do something fun. Yeah. I get to kill things? Hell yeah. Sign me up. Sorcerers? I love fighting those. Yeah. Just saw a hole open up somewhere and was just like, I'm dropping in, man. <laughs> Where we dropping, boys? I don't know what the circumstances are. Surely I might even die but I'm jumping in this thing. Let's yeah. see how it goes. I you can't die twice. He's I not can, afraid. But... <laughs> yeah, well, I guess after you come back to life, it's all bets off because you already died once. What's another time going to be? Yeah. It's not that bad. Surely, if anything, he probably didn't feel nothing. Death was just nothing for him. He came back and was like, well, there was no uh, afterlife, so yeah. might as well enjoy it before I go back to forgetting everything in the abyss. After yeah. he ate a fucking ho- hollow purple point blank. <laughs> yeah, he did. He did eat that, though. Well, if we'll, what we'll say, and he wouldn't have even known. He's just coming True. off of peak performance into uh, a peak random performance. Life. Yeah. <laughs> he, do- he has no clue. Um, for all he knows, he teleported from one world to the next. Is that technically time travel? I mean, to, if, if to on, under his presumption, it would be like you're peak living, and then you show up into another world, and you're like, well, I still gotta kill these sorcerers. So. Yeah. Um, that's the only thing he knows. And now there's a plethora. And it's his son. And a fish god. And a fish god. How about Beyond. that, man? That's so cool. I, I never Sam gave character. that thing. I love that guy. I mean, you, you see him in the background, he's done nothing the whole show I never gave him any deeper thought than Little Squid Man in the background yeah and uh, and he hadn't even like hatched Cocoon I don't even know what you want to call it he was still a cursed room he wasn't even like a full fledged right. cursed just, spirit at just sitting there being the adopted baby yeah. of Ghetto just chilling yeah. and he showed feelings because he was mad that they, his friend was dead right. he yeah. said we all have feelings well he, he said we, we all have names too. we all have names like, right? yeah that's what he said yeah, that kind of, like, uh, I hate feeling bad for the bad guys. Especially when they're, like, eternal demonic beings. But, like, <laughs> right. but just the fact that he was, like, listen here, you curse. And he's, like, I have a name. And he's, like, you killed my best friend. We all have names. Or, like, my older sister, brothers, whatever. Like, you know, like, you're just, you guys are horrible people. And it's, like, damn. I feel sad. I feel sad when they're sad. Like when he had the tears in his eyes, Caleb's like, oh, he's crying. Like, then he immediately vomits up 4,000 skeletons. And I don't care anymore. All right, I well, now I don't care. And he's wallowing on the ground. I wanted him dead, dude. I wanted him to get crushed. Yeah, no. He's I making mean, me mad. He's the, the easiest one to enjoy as a villain because he's just like a giant crustacean that just eats. He bottom feeds. Yeah. To him, the sorcerers, they're just bottom feeders like any of your crabs. Yeah. Is it okay to kill a crab after? Yeah, because it's going to taste yummy octopus doesn't taste that bad so i wouldn't mind killing him do i feel bad in the moment yeah just like all animals yeah i still gonna eat the bitch so it's all good octo bitch listen here octo bitch um definitely cthulhu inspired i mean that's yeah. not even bro's mean. name was that's literally not big a stretch bro. that is the design of it yeah wings and all butt wings um, yeah i know <laughs> the most useless tiny butt wings just go out of his back he said oh you can hover you don't, the wings weren't even flapping. He was just in the air, all buff for no reason. Yeah. That's how I'd want to fly. I'd have to, like, flex, like, my traps, and I would just, like, float. It's, uh... <laughs> it reminds me as useless. wasn't, like... Talk about the My Hero music today. It wasn't Ida's brother, like, have jets on the most inconvenient spot on the body. It was, like, a giant, like... It was, like, shoulder... Uh, elbow. <laughs> it was, like, elbow. I was, like, how do you use that stuff? How did these wings work on me? Oh. Lifting this... 500 pound creature <laughs> this crustacean creature did we get it does it have a name i didn't dagon 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 oh. that's why i, got, I was yeah. like bro, his name is actually the Vigon. ancient fish god there you go literally is the fish god <laughs> babylonian era it's great um fantastic but yeah and then we also had the old man so his name is Nalbito. Nalbito, zenin and he's got basically like animation abilities that's he's very cool yeah so he can he he can move he basically can move twenty four frames in a second, right. but they all have to be like thought out, not break the laws of physics and like momentum, and they have to be reasonable. And he can't uh, divert from it because if he does, then he freezes. And he can force someone else after he touches them to, like, have the same thing, but they're not expecting it. So they just freeze frame, and he gets to punch them at that point. I feel like if they freeze frame and they're, like, stuck in, like, glass, like, it kind of seemed like, why would you just hit them? Why, why couldn't you just right? leave them? 
Because it seemed like as soon as they like broke the glass, the creature was ready. To well, yeah, it was just normal. Well, or it would just fly away, like it got punched, and then it's like, you know, that way. Right. Pew, pew. All the film, uh, film nerds, sure loved that. Yeah. Uh, I also love how like every single sorcerer's abilities, so this season at least, they get explained like with um, what's her name again, May May. Mm-hmm. Like her ability, and then Navito's. It's like, oh, by the way, this all can happen. This can happen. This can happen. Um, and no one can beat this except Gojo. <laughs> Go, right, Gojo right, can right. survive. Yeah, they had to preface everything by like, he's the second coolest guy, but Gojo guys, yeah. come on now, remember him? It's a good he's way in to prison. Re- yeah, it's a good way to establish the power scaling. Nothing, nothing beats him. So if we don't know how powerful something is, let's compare it to him. Yeah. Give it a number value. Under Gojo. <laughs> like, we have the infinite, the and then fifth, just The under. fifth fastest person behind Gojo and four others. Yeah. Oh, and they I, even said, like, Jogo was fast, too. Yeah, like, that was, was yeah. as fast as Jogo. Yeah, or he, he said that the old man was as fast as Jogo. Or faster, I'm sorry. Faster than Jogo. I like that, yeah. that he explained things that potentially will have no value in the show, but it's still nice as a viewer to know. Like, like how you said, the 24 frames, like the villain would have to find a way to figure that out and then properly project themselves in a pattern that doesn't break the 24 uh, framed image so you don't have a, like a, a mix-match movement. It's also just really funny to know that the, the writing team behind this did this knowing it's going to get sent to a, uh, like an animation studio one day to be done because it's like a little... Tease like if you do, if you mess up this scene, yeah. So, I mean, because because uh, there's that famous example from the One Piece show of those two guys walking and this the frames are out of line when they walk. What's oh it? yeah, Duff Flamingo, whatever. <laughs> Duff Flamingo and Kumo <laughs> walking and it's just like don't end up like awful. them, yeah. or you'll mess up big time. It looks really bad. I I saw that scene <laughs> like when I was watching it. And I was like, hold on, and I did rewind it. And I was like, that looks like shit. <laughs> that looks so bad. And then the next scene looked fine. Yeah. Well, it's even like in claymation. All you have to do is just get almost close. You don't have to match it up because no one really detects 24 frames in a, a sequence because it happens in a second. So. Yeah. I, I like... Um, I, I really do. I've said it already like three times every episode. But I just like the narrator. It's just fun. It it's it's, nice. it's, it's, like it's it. just a nice like touch to give the what's going on. The one thing I would really like and... Another show. I don't say it. Fuck it. Hunter Hunter because it's so far along you won't remember. But Hunter Hunter does the same thing with the narrator where they explain things. Or Hunter uh, the narrator explains things. But a lot of times they'll do it in like um like a book mode where it's like Sam feels dread for what is about to come like that kind of thing on top of explaining it. So I would like that to like if it's like an intense moment in the story and like. Um, oh, in, in JJK. Yeah, yeah, in JJK. Like, it would be, fu- it would be fun. Itadori felt lost in this moment. Three seconds have passed. <laughs> Chozo <laughs> realized. <laughs> Chozo <laughs> realized, that's my brother. Yeah. That's, that, that's my brother. Well, it would just be cool. <laughs> it would just be cool if, like, in a moment where it's, like, they all find Itadori. Like, just imagine this. Like, they all find Itadori. Like, everybody comes together, and they're trying to rally the troops to fight Ghetto. And then it was, like, at this very moment... The crowd fell, uh, like, the room fell silent, and Sakuna emerged, and, like, he murders the whole, all, like, all the cast. You know what I mean? I don't want something like that to happen, but if that was to happen, that would be wild, and, like, having, an, like, the silence of, like, maybe just the music in the background, and then the narrator going over it, it would be, like, really cool. So, that's one thing I would like to see from the narrator. If they do or don't do it, it's not the end of the world. I like the way the narration is and the way the story is going, but... What was the thing about uh, the old man today? The narrator said, like, his power coincidentally worked perfectly with this domain expansion. So it's not lo- not exactly like the blue haired girl where it lines. She doesn't have like a strong domain, but it guarantees an exact hit. It's similar to that, but in this instance, it works as like a defensive system. It's so when counter. he enters in, oh, yeah. when a creature is gonna appear in the last moment, his his domain expansion? That's his? No, so it's so like it's, an anti... It's basically like an anti-air gun domain. But, but was that a curse technique, or like was that his simple domain? It's it not a simple... Simple domain is like... 
simple domain is like without having all the like right. hullabaloo of a domain. It's like if you get close enough to like with the sword thing. It's like if you get within like six feet of me, boom, instant hit, no matter what. That's a simple domain. What the old man had was basically like in instead of like an instant hit. It's like an instant defense for a domain. So he didn't activate a full domain. It was just like a technique to protect yourself. Okay, so it was cursed technique. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this cursed energy would like counter any hit. So as soon as it like touched him, his cursed energy would like kill the thing or push it yeah. away. Yeah, but it yeah. wasn't. It didn't have anything to do with his his cursed technique, which is the frame thing. Yeah, the, the no frames were involved. It was a technique passed down through his family. His family right? That's what they said. So, like you know, I guess in theory, like if Maki had cursed energy, she could do she it could too because she's right? in his family. So, perfect time to yeah. use it. Yeah, good call. Especially because Fish was throwing zero percent at you, and seventy at a. Seventy and thirty at old man and businessman. Yeah. Um, also, how they, how one only got an arm lost and Nanami took nothing is beyond me. But Nanami is the goat, so I guess I shouldn't question it. It's yeah. fine. Love Nanami. And Nabito was drunk a little bit, so maybe if he was sober, sober. he wouldn't have lost his arm. But he's a drunk piece of shit. Seventy years, he didn't need it, man. Seventy-one no, years has his arm. He's <laughs> like, okay, bro, no one cares. He's like, you're gonna pay for that one. You're gonna pay it for my arm. <laughs> I like. I, that's one thing I like about this show, or so far, is like, I feel, or not just the show. I like an anime a lot of times. Not all of them do it, but I like when they're not afraid to actually add grave stakes into sure. the story or the fight. You know, like when a character <clears throat> loses their eye or they loses a they lose a hand or an arm or a leg or something. Like it just makes you feel like there's something actually in stake at stake instead of like, oh we fought each other to the bloody end and then I was fine. I got healed. Magic right. hit cr- you yeah. know what I mean? Like I have an ability <laughs> that just regrows limbs. Like Hunter Hunters that also Well that's the it's literally that's what these two have in common. Yeah, it's like the violence is meaningful because because it actually it affects means the something. people. Yeah, like if it affect like you see a guy get his leg cut off, it's not gonna grow back. Yeah. like in other anime, hopefully not. Unless you're yeah. a Well, I was gonna say that's the Unless nice thing about this show too. Is, curses, uh, you know. Having a big cast does pay off in a lot of good ways like this, where you have enough fodder in the skies to not know who's going to go sometimes and also it's also the show's been set up in quite a way that it feels like even the main character can die like i i've never really put it off the table <laughs> each story's already technically died in the show yeah. uh, in a roundabout way but i've never actually never thought that he couldn't die he's one of those main characters that i'm like yeah i actually could because we have people like yuta who've been like established through the movie and hinted at in the show and we have people like Gojo and Megumi and Nabara that are like, like I said, Itadori. Pretty main. Like, like Itadori always gets like never like the main screen. Like a lot of time he gets sidelined. So it's one of the shows where I feel like, uh, yeah, he could be replaced in my mind. Like I, I wouldn't doubt it. The only problem is I, I don't have the most investment in the, these characters uh, compared to other shows. But that's just a me thing. But like for all the people who like really die hard love this show, I'd be worried if I were you because the show doesn't feel like. Uh, people are gonna stay around to be honest, and I'm also I've been a big uh, villain stand for a while. Yeah. On this team since since day one, I've been a Sakuna uh, fan, yeah. which you idiots can't realize when I say I like him. I like Sakuna. I like Ghetto. I like Mojito, and I'm worshiping their praise, and I'm waiting for the downfall of some of these guys, except for Nanami. There's like a few people that really don't want to be touched <laughs> at, in this show. Me too. Like, <laughs> some the good guys I really don't want to be touched. Uh, Nanami, uh, Itadori, I really do love. He's a he's a good main character. I want more spotlight on him. Those two are my deep grace. Everybody else, I'm like hit or miss. So yeah, for all of those that really love him, good luck. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know. There's something about all the characters. I feel like like I feel like the cast is kind of like in a childlike way. Like they're cute. I'm like I want to protect all of them. Like I don't want to. Like I don't really care about Inumaki. Rice boy, but like, if he dies, I'd feel kind of sad. Not on me, I'd be. Oh hard. yeah. Not on me, Itadori, Megami, I'd be heartbroken. Maki, I like her a lot too. I would be like, God damn, like, dude, don't, don't do this to me. Yeah. 
I'm also just a natural op for the show, so I know I'm going to feel bad when they die, because oh, yeah. I'm being an intentional ass about it, but, like, when Panda goes, I'm going to feel horrible about it, because oh, he's... God. Panda so, goes, I know. horrible. His <laughs> Panda's so sweet. Rice Boy, I've got, I really shouldn't have any That's going to be the worst Toto, oh, Toto, I'll put Toto as my yeah. top three, don't kill. But, like, yeah. Toto's number one for me. If I see that man go <clears> down, I'm going to be pissed. <clears throat> I'm going to be so upset. I'm just curious if, like, at this point, because this is getting, like, a little out of hand, are... <laughs> Like, other people going to step in, or are we just going to be stuck with, like, the crew that we have? Like, Toto was flashed in this, um, in the OP, and right. he said he wanted to do a mission with Itadori, but he couldn't because of the whole him recommending promotion thing. <clears throat> but, like, I don't know. It's like, you you just somewhere in Africa, like, learning to be cool and shit, and Toto's just, like, fucked off somewhere. So, like, I don't know. He's at home watching TV. He's probably he's at watching home. watching models or whatever. He yeah, does. the the or lady idols. the lady that he's obsessed with. Like honestly, that's probably why I feel the way I do. Is because the the villains are. Did around. you relate? <laughs> no. Sorry. <laughs> no, because the villains are around more than the heroes. Like yeah. those guys occupy more of the screen than a lot of these people. Like May and Maki, they were here for the second half of season one, and I actually I did like the sisters in their background, but that's been it for them. Mechamara, rest in peace. He was awesome. But he was there very, yeah. very briefly, and now he's gone. In I think forever. Yeah, no, so, I mean, he's dead. <clears throat> like it sucks. They I gave don't him really to attach to him. They gave him two really strong episodes, but they did not give him much time. Yeah, yeah. on screen. Right. I feel so displaced. Like I love Toji. They killed him, and now he's back. Should I invest again? Yeah, it's hard. Toji know. stocks are up once again. <laughs> we back. <laughs> we back. We, we back, back in this real. bitch. Gojo. Sam's a D1 Gojo hater. Oh, yeah, man. Um, YouTube comments have caused my friend to hate Gojo. I don't care who it is. Mo- Mojito, Ghetto, Sakuna. Kill him? Kill who? Kill- no! Stop it. I hate that. Don't do that to me. Don't do that to me. I love roll, Gojo. Roll the edit of Sakuna appearing over my face. You are my special. <laughs> yeah, no, don't kill Gojo. I love him, too. That's a that's one, I just don't think. Yeah. I don't think. I just enjoy Sam's hatred, recent hatred of Gojo. Hell no. More recent hatred. Kill him, man. Kill him. It, it went from kind of indifference to just full on hate. <laughs> He's like how I initially felt about Levi. If I never got cured about Levi, <laughs> I never became a slow fan. Just kill him. Just wait. No, keep him down in the dungeons with all the berserk skeletons, please and thank you. No! <laughs> Not the berserk skeletons. <laughs> the berserk skeletons. This was, this was a good episode, though. It was a great episode. This was episode. a great one. I really liked it. And I like where this show, this Shibuya arc's been so good. Yeah. I love the color palette change, too. Yeah, we went from good. Subway to, like, really vibrant beach. Yeah, that was, was great. awesome, dude. Speaking and of, that music was crazy. Yeah. I want to say, I, ha- I saw a JJK post on Instagram, and they were talking about the Chozo Itadori fight saying that the lights were inspired by cyberpunk. How cool is that? Oh, that is cool. I mean, how cool is that? I thought you would appreciate that. I saw that once they shared, shared that with you. Cyber, cyberpunk stocks up as well. <laughs> but not, David uh, Martinez, not, not David. David, David Martinez. David Martinez. David Martinez. Oh, Adam smashes up as hell. I'm trying to find his coat in the game. I still haven't gotten that quest, bro. I'm so annoyed. <laughs> I, w- I want to... Run it back for my man. Just leave this outro with cyberpunk music. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah, anything else? Uh, no. I couldn't wait for you to come and clear the covers. All right, bye, guys. We love you. Hope you enjoyed this reaction. Uh, make sure you let us know your favorite moment from today, because there's actually quite a full, a bunch to pick from. And for now, we'll see you in the next episode. Bunch of. Oh. <coughs>